What's up, Bargain family? Welcome back to my channel. So today we're in Dollar Tree checking out what's new. You have to come to the kitchen section of Dollar Tree. There's so many new items like the Simple Made Collection. So many different things to choose from here. So first off, there's a sink caddy and you stick this against your sink and put things inside of it. They have a soap dish. So you put this on top of the sink and the water will drain out. I ended up getting the sink caddy. This is perfect if you don't have a place to put a sponge and it sticks really nicely to the sink. There's also this little area where you can put something like a bottle brush inside of. Something similar to this on Amazon is $24.99. Granted, that one is stainless steel, but if you go with the one that's plastic from Amazon, it's $9.99. There's these sink strainers that look like sunburst. And then I really like these. These are dispensing dish brushes. So they have this one and then this one. I ended up getting the Starburst sink strainers. These are a silicone material. You can find a four pack for $8.99 on Amazon. I also ended up getting the dispensing dish brush. The way that this works is you twist the top off, fill it up with dish soap, put the top back on, and then you just press a button and it lets the soap out. It's a great brush for the price. Something like this retails for $9.99 on Amazon. I also got the seal brush. You do the same thing. You twist the top off, fill it up with some soap and press the button to let the soap out. This one I liked a lot and something similar on Amazon retails for $8.99. So definitely saving money at Dollar Tree. And then way up there, I'm too short, they have a bottle brush, which honestly, we use bottle brushes all the time in my house because I do have an infant, so that's pretty cool. Now I'm sad to report I also got the bottle brush. This was very flimsy and the top ended up coming off. So it was about, I would say, three minutes into washing dishes with this that the top ended up unraveling. So do not recommend the bottle brush, but everything else I really liked. So these are new to Dollar Tree and I'm so excited about them. It's these stackable wine bottle holders and you can use these for more than just wine. You can use these for your protein shake bottles, for bigger water bottles, your Stanley cups. These are great for the price. These are such a steal at $1.25. On Amazon, two of these retail for $15.99. They hold wine bottles so nicely. And for me, I will be using these to hold water bottles and shaker bottles, which we have a lot of. It allows you to save so much space inside of your kitchen cabinets. Highly, highly recommend these. This is also new to Dollar Tree, Turn Tables, and this is a Dollar Tree brand. I'm gonna actually buy one of these and see if it works out. This is a great price as well. I like these Lazy Susans for $1.25. I think they have a good spin. When you're spinning them, they're gonna move around, but once you get something inside of it, it's gonna stay put. It actually held more containers than I thought it was going to. And a four pack on Amazon of these Lazy Susans are $19.99, making them $5 each. I would run to Dollar Tree and get them for $1.25. I do think they're worth it. If you have an air fryer, they have these air fryer liner parchment sheets, which is really cool for keeping it clean. I love the air fryer. It's my favorite place to make chicken wings of all things. They come out so crispy in there. You need to run to the frame section of Dollar Tree and pick up these mirrors. Let me tell you, you can make a beautiful, beautiful craft with this. Also, this is who's behind the camera. Is it picking up? <laughs> Do not spend over $200 on this Pottery Barn mirror when you can make it with the Dollar Tree mirrors. You're gonna get a heavy duty glue. I'm gonna be using Gorilla Glue and you're gonna glue the mirrors together. Now I'm gonna make three sets of mirrors that have three mirrors glued in each row. I wait for the glue to completely dry before attaching these three sets together. To make this sturdier, I grab a foam board piece from Dollar Tree, I cut it so that it fits the back of my mirrors perfectly, and then I glue that into place. Now I'm just gonna place this on top of my fireplace and lean it against the wall. If you wanna hang this up, there are these little picture hanging hooks in the back of each mirror, so you can go ahead and hang them off of a nail on your wall and do it that way. I actually think this mirror is prettier than the Pottery Barn mirror just because because of the details on the mirror. It's so beautiful and you can attach multiple ones together to make this freestanding. You can glue it to a piece of wood. It's completely up to you. However, it looks great for the price. Also in the frame section, you're gonna find these arched mirrors. Get these, you can make these look so nice and they have arched picture frames. When I saw these mirrors, I knew I had to paint them gold. So I went ahead, put my painter's tape on top of the mirror and then I got my rub and buff anti gold paint and basically I just buff this into the mirror. I really like this rub and buff. I think it has more of a realistic gold look to it versus just regular acrylic paint that's gold. 
Rub and Buff has so many beautiful colors to choose from. I just went ahead and placed the mirrors near my bigger arch mirrors and it is gorgeous. I recently bought this gold frame with this flower picture for $9 and I was like, I can make this with the Dollar Tree picture frames. So again, I painted them gold and this time around I got the flower canvas art from Dollar Tree. I put my piece of glass over the art, figure out where I want to cut it, trace it, and then cut it out. Put it back inside of the picture frame and look how beautiful these turned out for a fraction of the cost for what I paid for that other one. And you can make so many of these on the cheap. These are also new for Mother's Day. They hold bouquets and these will be great to just give the bouquet and make it look a little nicer or make a gift out of. Mother's Day is less than a month away. They have these picture frames that have a beautiful mirror around them. Pick them up because you can make a beautiful gift using these. Now that lady now that is lady the best is lady by par. The best lady by par. <laughs> This is an easy and beautiful Mother's Day gift idea. Go ahead and buy those frames and put pictures inside of there. Once you have your pictures inside of them, you're gonna rip the back piece off where there's just like a stand and then glue the mirrors together. Now, you cannot buy five mirrors because the fifth one is not gonna fit perfectly on the bottom. So what I did is I just grabbed an extra piece of cardboard I had laying around the house. I traced the frames on top of the cardboard cut it out and then glue that to the bottom. You can always use a piece of foam board from Dollar Tree, but like I said, five mirrors, they're not gonna fit perfectly together. I filled this up with fake flowers. If you wanna use real flowers, don't put them inside till the day of. And then I got Ferrero Rocher, is that how you see? I can't, that was so bad. Ferrero Rocher. And I got some bamboo skewers from Dollar Tree, pushed them through the chocolate and then put that throughout the flowers. It just looks really pretty, inexpensive to do. And I'm sure any mother would love to get this for Mother's Day, especially when you put pictures pictures of you and your mom or maybe your um, daughter who just had a child. I don't know. I think it's a great idea. These travel size bottles are new to Dollar Tree. They're like four bottles in one. These are super cool, especially with summer coming up and vacations. This is my favorite travel bottle ever. You remove the lid to find four individual bottles that you can fill up with whatever you want. In general, travel bottles suck to fill with shampoo or conditioner. After you fill all the bottles up, just put them back in place and then put the cap on. This is awesome for summer vacations and I love the fact that it's so compact. There's a bridal hair collection right now at Dollar Tree and they have these beautiful hair clips, but we're not gonna use this for the hair. We're actually gonna use this for the table. You'll see. There's really pretty ones to choose from. I like this one right here, but my favorite one we're gonna be using is this one right here. For this hack, you just need hair clips and shower curtains. You're gonna remove the clip from the hair clip and then glue the shower curtains to the back of the clips. Now I used hot glue. I tried to use E6000, but it wouldn't hold when I try to mix some hot glue inside of there, still wouldn't hold, so I just did hot glue. These are supposed to be napkin rings, so I got these napkins with utensils from Dollar Tree, and I just placed my napkin rings over them. These came out so pretty. They actually look really high end when you're staring from the front. Obviously, the back, you can see it's a shower curtain, but who's really looking that hard? They have the most adorable hair clips in right now. Look at these, they're little popsicles. These would be so cute for Noelle when she has more hair. And then the little lemons, these are adorable. Right now at Dollar Tree, you can find this floral lip gloss and lipstick and it's so pretty. There's flowers on the inside of these. I think these are so gorgeous, especially to give as a gift. These are beautiful. Look how beautiful these are. So each lipstick has a blue, or pink flower, and then the same goes for the lip gloss. How pretty, actually, no, those are blue. On camera looks purple, but these are so gorgeous. The packaging of these lipsticks is so nice. Obviously the flowers inside of them look so pretty. I also got the lip glosses and the lipstick itself, it's a really pretty nice rose sheen. It's just supposed to enhance your natural lip color. Dollar Tree has so many new organizing items. This is new, a packing cube. So this is to put inside of your suitcase and keep everything nice and organized. So it's good if you wanna keep all your swimsuits in a bag or if you have like children, their outfits for the day and each little bag, I don't know, it says cube. I don't think it's a cube per se. These bags are great for keeping your suitcase organized. So you can put all of your linens inside of one of the bags, your socks inside of another bag. You can put each day of clothing inside of its own bag. These are great for children's clothing. So I put my kids swimsuits inside of one of the bags and then their pajamas inside of another bag. We're going to a water park soon. So this was great for that. Now I will say the bags are a little bit flimsy, but they get the job done. So I don't think they're bad for a dollar and 25 cents. They're just thinner. These are new and they're so pretty. So they feel like they are ceramic, but they look like they're wood. These are gonna be so pretty to do something with. They 
it's no longer a dollar. Ah. I'm gonna use these wax warmers to make candle pillars. So I glued three of them together. I just used hot glue. Hot glue works really well with ceramic materials. And then I glued two together to make my medium sized candle pillar. And then I just needed one for the smallest one. I put some Dollar Tree candles on top of these and you can see how beautiful they turned out. Just three of these cost me $7.50 to make. When I buy one of these, it doesn't even cost me $7.50. They came out really nice and look great with all the gold decor that I have. This is new to Dollar Tree, $1.25. It's like this jewelry making stuff. There's a bunch of different things to choose from, but I really like the beads, specifically the gummy bear beads I can use for my fake whipped cream toppers. They have letter beads and smiley face beads, which I think would be good for Mother's Day if you want to make your mom a little charm bracelet with the initials of maybe her children, um, maybe her dog because she likes her dog more than you, who knows? But literally a bunch of beads. They have like the cords and the strings for making necklaces and bracelets and even earring hooks. There's mermaid large hole beads, turquoise large hole beads, large hole bead bracelet, corded necklace bases, these little tassels. First off, let's take a moment to appreciate the gummy bear beads because they are so cute. So I ended up making a bracelet. I used the letters, the gummy bears, and the smiley faces. I took an N and a C to stand for Noelle and Cooper. Now this one is more fun. I know not everybody's gonna like a bracelet like this, but I love anything that reminds me of growing up in like the 80s and this just screams out with the smiley faces. There's other beads to choose from if this is not your style, but I do think the beads are so pretty for the price. They're bringing out the nautical items. They have so many cute items here. They have these seahorses that look very high end. They look like they cost more than $1.25. In this section, you're going to find these glass jars they had last year with these wooden lids that you can actually use in the kitchen for spices. Like I said, I purchased these glasses last year and I used them for spices still to this day. The labels I had gotten are also from Dollar Tree. I got them last year and just look how pretty this looks. Like you cannot buy a glass with that type of lid anywhere for that price. I think it looks so nice and high end. These are new, these messages in a bottle. I used to DIY these back in the day because they didn't sell them already made. So you can buy them now already made different colors. They brought back stuff they used to have like this ball. I really like these. They're just like these wooden chimes. Is that what this would be called? I don't know, it looks like a wind chime, but like with wood pieces. These are new this year. They didn't have them last year. There's a lot of things that we've already seen, like they carry this year after year. Same thing with this. It's been a few years of that. It's also been a few years of these. Those are new and they're really cute. So this one says relax, this one says enjoy. And again, it's something where it doesn't look like it costs $1.25. Like I swear I buy that at Hobby Lobby and it would at least be double the price, but more than likely triple. My favorite sign out of this collection is this one right here. I think it's cute. I feel like it would be nice in a bathroom. For some reason, nautical decor reminds me of a bathroom because that's the closest we would get to the beach. When you grow up poor, you just decorate your bathroom as a beach and that's the closest thing you're gonna get to it. <laughs> Dollar Tree right now is bringing out their solar lights and they got new solar lights this year. So they have these solar light lanterns that come with a hook that you can hang outside. And then they have rose gold lanterns, which I'm excited about because I love to do my floral chandeliers with these solar lights. I'm gonna be sharing some DIYs with these solar lights soon. So get them when you can, they are so nice. So they're bringing out the graduation items and I usually don't focus on this area too much, but they have these tumblers that look like a graduation cap that are just so cute. And if you have a Cricut, it would be fun to put the person's name and then like the year they graduated, which what year did you graduate high school? Cause I'm 2005, like I'm getting old. Next, is it next year? What year are we in? I, next year is going to be 20 years. The same, right? The same, I'm mad. Dollar Tree was like, we're going to raise the prices all around the store, but we are going to bring you some amazing items because literally, I'm telling you, this haul is just crazy. So they have these divided cases with these little sliders you can move around and then these craft boxes with a bunch of little circles and literally you don't have to use this for crafting, like you can use it for anything. So the obvious thing to use these cases for is for crafting because you're going to find them in the crafting section, but you don't have to do that. So one of the cases I made for little emergency items or things that I always need when I'm inside of the car. So so I put some band-aids, an oximeter, Tylenol, ibuprofen, and you can throw this really easily inside of your purse. And then another one, I just put things like makeup, 
extra toothpaste, extra floss, again, something you could throw inside of your purse or leave inside of the car. So this is really awesome because you can move it around to fit your needs. Then the cases with the little containers, again, the obvious thing is to use them for crafting. So I have a bunch of fake sprinkles I use for my fake sweets. This holds those little sprinkles real nicely. And then the other thing you could use them for is jewelry. So when you're traveling, if you're gonna bring a bunch of jewelry, like earrings, necklaces, rings, you can go ahead and put them inside of the containers and keep everything really compact inside of your purse or inside of your travel. If there's anything I recommend getting in the kids section right now, Dollar Tree, if you have children, are these kitchen sinks. So they actually work. They, you can buy similar ones on Amazon. They're bigger. They cost about $12.99. But if you want a little one, something, you know, for your kids to really have an interactive play, these are really good. All Patrol is all the rage. Trust me. I have a three-year-old and I know three-year-olds know four-year-olds. Dollar Tree right now is bringing out Paw Patrol stuff. And this is so cute. So these are bathroom squirters. So if you have like a toddler in your life, I feel like these are awesome, especially maybe for party favors. I'm going to get all of them for Cooper. He's going to be so happy. Speaking of Paw Patrol, they also have little Paw Patrol figurines because you know they have like Toy Story all the time, PJ Mask. Now they have Paw Patrol. They have Sky Chase, Marshall, and Rubble. Yes. Kind of know my Paw Patrol. Oh, and they brought Abby finally because they always have the Sesame Street figurines, but they finally brought Abby. So Noelle would be happy with this. You have to come to the party section of Dollar Tree. Noelle's birthday is just around the corner. Cinco de Mayo, Cooper is coming fast. So there's a bunch of items I want to get here. First off, they have these cake banner toppers. So you put them inside of the cake. There's different ones to choose from. They've got like the little scatter 3D ones. They have the decorative cake picks. Really pretty. I love the star ones. And I might get a few because I feel like I can use this amongst all the treats. Oh my gosh, I love the new birthday stuff. Look at this shaker from Dollar Tree. It is gorgeous. I just pushed this through a plain white cake and you can see like it just adds such a beautiful look to a plain white cake. For $1.25, I think it's awesome. I also tried using the little star that has the beads on it. There's different colors to choose from, but again, it's so pretty for the price. It can elevate a grocery store cake really easily. Like I said, Noelle's birthday is Cinco de Mayo. These are gonna be perfect. They're little mini pinatas. They're so cute. There's a unicorn, a cake, and a cupcake. I've never seen these before at Dollar Tree. So many cool items here as well, like a balloon stick that lights up. You get a clear balloon and it looks so cool. These don't come with the balloon, so you can go over to the balloon part and find the bubble balloons. So they're clear and you can use these if you want to. So what you're going to do is you're going to wrap your balloon around this little plastic piece that comes with your stick. Then you're going to feed your lights through the stick itself and then through that little plastic piece that's holding the balloon. Then wrap the lights around the balloon and then wrap it downward onto the stick. And this is so cool. Oh my gosh, if you are having like a teen birthday party or a toddler who loves to dance like Cooper, I think this is great. I think I'm gonna go with more of a dance party for Cooper and I think this is just gonna make his day to have everything glowing. These are new as well. So basically they always have like these foil balloon garland and that's what this is, except it's seven individual stars and they're so cute. You can put them throughout a garland. I wanna get these for Noel. The foil balloon garland from Dollar Tree is usually just one piece. I like that the stars are seven individual pieces. They come with the straw that you just use to blow up the foil. These are so nice and they would be great to put throughout a real balloon garland. These balloon chandeliers are new as well. They always have like the coolest things to make with balloons here. So they got like balloon towers I've showed before and yard balloon sticks. And these disco cups are new to Dollar Tree as well. So actually the Target Bulls like playground, they carry these, but they're like $3 there. This is just $1.25 here, a Dollar Tree. And this would be fun too for like Cooper's birthday, I think. I don't know, for him, I'm thinking like a dance party. We'll see. In the bridal baby section, there are these champagne bottles, but you can blow bubbles out of them. This is actually really cute, especially for like a bridal shower or a wedding. In the cleaning section of Dollar Tree right now, you'll find this all-purpose pink formula. It's supposed to be like the pink stuff. The They're Dollar Tree garland usually is just this one. Works. And you'll also find a bunch of LA Awesome kitchen the balloon, cleaners. And, the foil um, balloon garland from Dollar Tree is usually like just like one piece. And I like that the stars are seven that individual pieces. I don't know how well they come it works, with the straw that you just really use nice to blow up the foil. These are so nice and they would be great to put throughout a real balloon garland. There's so many great items on one trip. I didn't have to go to multiple Dollar Trees. Anyways, I will see you guys next time. Take care. Bye.